Hey, it's Matt from McGee Farms, and I've kind of shown you our setups on our poultry and some of our different animal housing. Taking care of uh, some neighbors' birds for a day or two, and while I'm over here, I was just kind of kind of go through and uh, uh, show you their setup a little bit too. This is uh, they've got a couple of chickens and they've got some turkeys. Uh, this guy's I think about two years old maybe a year and a half. He's not that old yet, but uh, they've got a little different setup. It's it's not a bad setup, not a, a few things I would change personally, but you know, it works. My only concern with it would be uh, for predators. Uh, and to start out with, you know, they've got a uh, small, small house in there. It's got a window that's facing towards where the sun comes up, so they're gonna get light in there early in the day. Small run, they have this uh, uh, this frame. This was a, a kit that they bought, and they have chicken wire. I think it originally had netting. They got uh, chicken wire to put over it. And like I said, it's a good setup for it. Uh, my only concern is when raccoons start getting crazy, you know, digging underneath it or Raccoons can even kind of chew through uh, wire, but uh, I've got a little nice little stock tank in there with electricity with a heater for the water. There's nesting boxes inside the uh, inside the house. Another thing, you come over here. This is actually their garden that's right next to it, but you can kind of see they've got a live trap in there for raccoons if they do come out, and marshmallows. Marshmallows work really good bait for raccoons. Uh, actually, raccoons and, believe it or not, alligators uh, love marshmallows. And uh, they'll go in there. So it's uh, it's good bait to use. Canned cat foods uh, and stink bait is what I use a lot, too. But just kind of wanted to, to show you a little different setup of uh, keeping poultry. This isn't for a whole lot of birds, but I think they've... Normally, they keep about eight to ten chickens and uh, these turkeys so you know it's a nice nice little bit for you know a homesteader it's matt from mcgee farms hope you enjoy the video if you do give us a thumbs up leave us a comment to subscribe to the channel it's always appreciated and it helps us grow until next time have a great day